hey guys so here we have got another problem which is a very simple looking problem but a very tricky one and indeed a very beautiful question so the question says that we have got 1.005 raised to power 200 so this basically this is a decimal number also and it has been raised to some power also and versus 2 so we have to compare that which one is greater which one is smaller now 2 is a very simple number and if I would have got some power over 2 then I would have done some up means I would have applied some brain but here it's a decimal so how you are gonna do that so uh, this 1.005 let's talk about this first so can I write 1.005 in some other format like I can write it 1.005 but this gonna not gonna help me so can I write it like this okay in the fraction format so it's 1 plus 5 divided by 1000 okay so this 5 will cancel it in 200 okay so I'm getting some correlation means this can be written as 1 plus 1 upon 200 means 5 will cancel this 1000 in 200 times so we have got 1 plus 1 upon 200 this is the number 1.005 now if this number has been raised to power 200 so this is also raised to power 200 so we have got this number as 1.005 uh, as 1 plus 1 by 200 raised to power 200. Now we have to compare this with 2. So how we are going to do for this 2? What, what we are going to do? Let's see. We'll do something for this as well. So uh, if I am not wrong, 2 can be written as 400 divided by 200. I, I just want the same denominator as here. So 400 by 200, yes, it's possible. It's, it's very much possible. Now, um, can I write it like this? 201 divided by 200 into... Uh, into 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 202 divided by 201 okay I'll, I'll write the entire thing then I'll show you into 203 divided by 202 and then dot 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 this will go till 400 divided by 399 so basically what I have done I'll just show you so I have done one simple thing that here all the numbers this 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 will get cancelled and only this 400 and this 200 will remain okay but I don't have to cancel it right now but I can write it like this way I, I hope you all are understanding so I'll write it again so I can write it 201 divided by 200 into 202 divided by 201 and into 203 divided by 202 and so on sorry 202 and so on dot 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 till 400 divided by 399 now why have I written it like this so basically I want to write it in some format. So 201 can be written as 200 plus 1 divided by 200. So and, and similarly into this 202 can also be written as 201 plus 1 divided by 201. Similarly into 203 can be written as 202 plus 1 divided by 202 and cross dot dot dot. It will keep on going on. Fine. Now, uh, and the last term will be 399 plus 1 divided by 399. So basically, you are able to understand that this part, 200 and this denominator is same. So 200 by 200 is going to be 1. And then plus, I have got 1 upon 200. 1 upon 200 into, so this is a multiple, this is a bracket, into we have got 201 upon 201. So the, both the numbers are same. So both the numbers are same means again 1 plus 1 upon 201. Correct? and into the same way 1 plus 1 by 202 and moving on and on and on dot 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 till here we will get 1 upon 1 by 399 now how is this going to help me to compare this number 2 with this number 1.005 raised to power 200 so here we have to understand one thing see this 1 upon uh, 1 plus 1 upon 200 raised to power 200 if i want to write it i can even write it like this see uh, 1 plus 1 upon 200 raised to power 200 can be written as 1 upon 1 plus 1 upon 200 into 1 plus 1 upon 200 into 1 plus 1 upon 200 and so on till 200 terms so 1 plus 1 upon 200 so this is my first number 1.005 raised to power 200 now if I talk about the second number that was 2 so 2 we have just now seen, I have written it in the format 1 plus 1 by 200, 1 plus 1 by 201, 1 plus 1 by 202 and so on. So here if I write it like that, 1 plus 1 by 200 
then 1 plus 1 by 201 and then 1 plus 1 by 202 and then so on dot 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 till 1 plus 1 by 399. Now please pay attention that here you will be able to see very clearly that we have been able to get this 1 1 same, numerator is also same, here denominator same, the first term is same but moving forward denominator for the this first number 1.005 denominator is constant but here the denominator is increasing and you know that in a number if I have 1 by 2 and then 1 by 3 and then 1 by 4 as the denominator increases these numbers are going to be smaller like the largest number will be 1 by 2 then 1 by 3 will be second largest and 1 by 4 will be the smallest so these numbers are decreasing 1 upon 200 then 1 upon 201 then 1 upon 202 so these all numbers are in decreasing but here all numbers are constant so obviously here you will get a plus b 200 times but here you will get a plus b then a plus b minus something like a, a little smaller number then again a little more smaller and so on so hence this number is going to be finally smaller compared to the first number and hence we have achieved the conclusion or we have reached the conclusion that this first number 1.005 which is looking very small raised to power 200 is greater than 2 and that's the answer. I hope you liked and enjoyed the video. If that is the case, do let me know in the comment box and do like the video. Share this video with your friends as well. Ask them this question and see if they know the answer. Okay. With this, see you in the next video with the next question. Till then, take care. Bye-bye. So guys, I hope you loved and enjoyed the problem. And if that is the case, so I would like to give you one more problem as a challenge which you should solve and send me the answers. What do you say? So if, if you are ready, here is the problem. In this problem, what you have to do, you have to solve this question and write the answers in the comment box. If I get a lot of right answers, then I'm very, very happy. I'll be very happy to see all of you solving these challenging questions. And in case if you're not able to solve, just write down in the comment box that, sir, I'm not able to solve it. Kindly help or kindly guide. I'll be very happy and uh, based on the responses given by you guys in the comment box, I'll be bringing a solution video for this particular question in the next session okay so i hope you loved and enjoyed this video so if you if that is the case please write down in the comment box your valuable feedback do like the video and subscribe the channel for more such beautiful contents see you in the next video thank you